Well, good afternoon, everybody. <laughs> We're all so much better. I've been out to coffee, except we got to find a better coffee place. I'm starving. Um, they, they have, like, these gluten-free weird stuff to eat. Like, I, I don't mind a bran muffin, but um, I actually tried one of their gluten-free bran muffins. <sighs> I don't like gluten-free. Oh, did I tell you what my, uh, my, my dermatologist, because <laughs> uh, I probably failed to tell you this part. Yes, I need to lose about 10 pounds. We'll leave it at that. It, it comes out of my mouth easier. 10 pounds. -ish. <laughs> I don't want to say. But, because, uh, you know, my weight had been about the same, about the same, and about the same for three years. Now I'm up. So it's like, no, not acceptable. So I was telling you my skin doctor about that because she has a degree in physique oh I should well I didn't know I was going to talk about this or I would have looked it up basically in movement exercise stuff like that she actually has a PhD she holds an MD in dermatology and sur surgery dermatology she's not like one of those dermatologists that you go to see to get Botox no 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 she does only, only surgery and checks, you know, checks you out and takes out stuff. She's not a beauty dermatologist. She's a surgical dermatologist. <laughs> well, anyway, she holds a PhD in, uh, I don't know, exercise. We'll just say it's physio. I don't know. Phys well, I give up. in exercise. And I was telling her that because she wanted to know how my physical went, because I had just mentioned to the PA that, yeah, um, that, you know, I'd had a physical and all was well. Um, and she said, um, just move for one hour a day. She's from China. And I said, and she goes, and only eat one carbohydrate at a time. She says, no two pieces of bread, one bread, no mashed potatoes and biscuit, biscuit or mashed potatoes. But she said to move just for one hour a day that there has been, and maybe she has done, a study of women 60 and older. And all you have to do is move for an hour each day. And she, she said, and if your knees or back hurts, which is common, then sit down, relax for a minute, take the weight off. And then she said, just add whatever time you took off to that. And she said, after 30 days, you can move for one hour with no problem. So, <laughs> I'm not going to move for one hour. <laughs> I know I'm not. So I'm back to doing the 15 minutes at a time cleaning. And I'm going to do that egg bake. I looked it up and, you know, it's really funny because they said, the best thing to make this with is bacon. And it's like, ah, oh, ah, oh, I bought sausage. I've eaten so much bacon lately. It's like enough. I've eaten more bacon than what I normally eat in like six months. In the last two months. So, we're going, like sausage is a whole bunch better. I don't know. But I do love that Jimmy Dean sausage. So it's blowing, the wind is horrendous here. It's been horrendous here for two years, uh, for two years. It's been horrendous here forever since they invented the city uh, for two days, two years. <laughs> oh, oh no, two days. Um, they say uh, blizzards are moving in for real this time. I hope it's not too bad because I have a mammogram to go to. Um... Yes, it's mammogram. Then it's uh, get teeth done, get my teeth cleaned. I'm hoping that's all that has to be done. And um, and then I doctor, and then I'm done. Um, so so I hope it doesn't snow too much. 
I mean, if it snows like a foot, I'm okay. But anything over that, it just would take me too much to shovel the car out. I, I don't have a garage. <laughs> oh, but the wit is probably my hair looks like, you know, the Bride of Frankenstein. <laughs> So, let's see, on the list to clean. Um, well, and answering comments is on that list. So I will be doing that too. Um, uh, I'm trying to decide what's the most important. Well, I have to do dishes first. And sweep the floors. Um, uh, um, no way can I walk through barefooted here, especially after my grand... Yeah, I always blame it on the grandkids. I love having grandkids. Oh, I have a spot on my thing because of grandkids. No. Oh, did I ever tell you I'm real OCD about spots? Like, if I look down and see a spot, I will immediately change my shirt. I have a spot thing. I don't like to wear any clothing that has a spot on it. And, like, if I'm out and I find it, I freak out. So many, I have several pens of that stuff you're supposed to be able to take spots out with, but I don't know where they are. I lose them. Um, oh, I'll talk to my daughter today. She is um, going to open her own business up and work as a subcontractor. Um, she's worked out a deal and she will be working for two separate businesses. And it was funny because we were trying to think, you know, and she ran the couple names by me, and we kind of picked one. And, but my <laughs> Kylie's in the background going, pretty as a flower. I'm telling you, name your company pretty as a flower. She's very animate about it. So, But it's not going to be pretty as a flower. I tried to tell Kylie that it's already been taken. She wouldn't believe it. She's not an easy one. To, you know, she may be only, what? seven she's seven or eight she's seven she will be eight uh, but you can't pull the wool over that girl's eye very very quickly well let's see I'm telling you just dirty house and I'm gonna make the egg bake um, apparently it is um, hash browns meat cheese and then eggs and I have to make it because I want to I don't want that I have a whole I think almost a whole dozen eggs if not a dozen eggs I'll have to look to see how many I have um I should have looked because I come to I don't know yeah I, yeah I have a whole dozen yes and I don't want them to go bad lately a lot of eggs have been thrown away um I just, as soon as that, the exploration of the carton comes up, I go, nope, no good. I'm a little paranoid over it. I'm starting to sound neurotic with all the stuff I'm paranoid over. Spots, eggs, um, <laughs> I don't know. Well, I guess I'm going to put the first, first 15 minutes on and do the kitchen and sweep. And then next will be the bathroom and starting on my dresser. Cannot see the dresser again. There is a pile of clothes, literally, if you could see it, that tall, of clean clothes. I just like keep washing them and throwing them on top of the dresser. <laughs> I have to fold up the clothes so that I can get the sheets that are going on the bed today. <laughs> I did it. That was my first 15 minutes. Hey, before I tell you how that went, I got to tell you, I miss Chris Ann. I miss Chris Ann's beautiful face. Mm -hmm. Hi, Chris Ann. Um, if you don't know Chris Ann, I will put a card. Because I have all my rights back. <laughs> I, I, I tell you. <laughs> so this is, you know, all said and done. And I finally got an email from them <laughs> days after this. It was dated, but I did not receive it. Uh, Google. Google is getting really weird. Uh, <laughs> I finally got one that said, oh, by the way, 
you have been tagged as inappropriate content we're taking that video down and then I finally got one saying oh we reviewed your appeal and you won and we're giving you back all your rights you are now in good standing it was like thanks for telling me after the fact guys I got two emails at once <laughs> really swift on those emails <laughs> so I'm back in good standing and I can make custom thumbnails and everything again Thank you for telling me last night. <laughs> so anyway, I got all the dishes loaded. Um, I scrubbed down the counters. Um, I still have not dealt with the coffee pot issue. I still have three coffee pots sitting. One there, it's, it's like the golden triangle of coffee pots. <sighs> I just don't want to deal with it this week. <laughs> I think with medical week and another medical week coming and going on because it like goes on for uh, two weeks and one day um, let's see two one week two one. I'm, I'm really good at math let's see uh, Friday through Friday that's seven uh, no, Thursday through Friday, that's eight, nine, ten, eleven days. Medical, medical month takes place in eleven days. Yeah, maybe. Kinda. Because I'm not sure um, what day my appointment with the eye doctor is. We'll just say two weeks. That's why it's medical month. So, let's see, so I did the 15 minutes, and I got the floor mostly swept. I got all the dishes put away in there. I scrubbed out the sinks real good. If you ever want to make uh, stainless steel sinks look really pretty, just take either Comet and fine steel wool, or a, I call them Brillo pads, SOS pads, and scrub them. And it just makes them look so pretty and get really good around the sides with one of them. Um, so I got that done. Uh, top of the stove just bare, like kind of wiped off. I tell you, I, got, I, I have to pull the black things off and scrub them around. I've never been able to find inserts. You know how like people have those aluminum inserts so you can just chuck them. I've never been able to find them. I'm thinking about lining it with just aluminum this time cutting a hole in aluminum <laughs> and doing it but aluminum can be pretty flammable sometimes so I'm a little scared on doing that one um so let's see um let's see so I got the pot cleaned I got um, all the hand washing done it's like my water bottle thermos stuff I like to wash them really good so I do them by hand Tells you how much faith I have in my dishwasher. Not much. So next 15 minutes is I'm going to start with the clothes on my dresser because I need to have the sheets so I can change my sheets. Because tonight I'm planning a big um, not going out. Not going out. I'm tired. I am really, really tired. I think it's going to take a little more time than what I think, you know. I think after one day, I think, okay, I'm fine. I'm not. I'm not. I'm just not. So I need to find my sheets. Oh, did I tell you, Michelle, my friend Michelle gave me um, what I consider, I love utilitarian presents. So for Christmas, knowing this, she got me two pairs of thousand count sheets and what is really cool not that the thousand count isn't uh, is they both came with four pillowcases because I have four pillows I have like a a fluffier feather I'm not sure if you can understand this and then a really thin feather that I kind of like wad up yeah, you know, I think if 
you know, I'm like the blinky type. I like hold on, you know. So they're beautiful sheets. Um, and I would like to put the first pair back on. Um, I've used both pairs. They're lovely. I love, you know, I love soft sheets. I really love. When Martha Stewart came out with her line of stuff at Kmart, I bought a set of her sheets and I actually made Kmart take them back even though that I had washed, put them on and washed them trying to soften them and put them back on and, lay, and just got in bed and went, oh, these are so scratchy, man. I can't take these. I made Kmart take them back. It took me uh, quite a bit of talking to get them. I just said, this is just crap. And I mean, you know, the thread count wasn't that high, but she swore they were beautiful, beautiful cotton sheets made out of a really nice cotton and blah, blah, blah. And I fell for it. And it, and I was just so mad. Oh, so anyway, I do, Chris and I miss you a bunch, and I will put a card since I now have all my rights back to her channel. Because if you do not know Chris Ann, you have to. I think I watched one of the first hauls of hers. It was a actually clothing haul, and I went, oh, I love that. I would wear everything that girl just bought, and that's what I knew. That girl was for me, and I subscribed instantly. <laughs> Well, that almost killed me, that 15 minutes. I hate to fold clothes. I hate to. Oh, I got most of the clothes folded. The sheets changed. I went to wash the sheets. I said, oh, no, 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 no. No washing sheets till you get all the clothes cleaned, I uh, mean, folded up and put away. I got most of them. Like, I mean, all the clothes that need to be hung is always hung because I don't dry them. Almost, it, no, I don't dry any of these sweaters. And it looks like I'm always wearing the same thing, but I'm not. I have about 10 tank top, well, tank and camis um, that kind of look the same. Except every now and then you'll see lace. And I have, like, this is actually a cashmere sweater. <laughs> I'm cleaning I, I don't ever wear this cashmere sweater because it, it's just not the right style to go with anything I own. So I finally decided that I just wear it every day. Why not? I like cashmere. It feels good on your skin. Uh, <laughs> but it uh, looks like <laughs> when people first meet me, they go, do you wear the same thing over and over? And it's like, no. I very seldom even wear the same outfit twice. I'm one of those people that go through clothes really bad because I wear it one time. Unless I just wear it briefly for like an hour. Maybe I'll hang it back up. I think today is like all my phobias and idiosyncrasies. <laughs> like I'm fluffing my pillows. Two of my four pillows to right now. Because every time I change my sheets I fluff my pillows. <laughs> Well, one, I get some heat in them, and I put one of those smelly things. Um, uh, what you, uh, dry, uh, dryer sheets. So they smell, oh, nice and clean. Mm -mm. And, I, and then they all, they're all fluffy because they're feather. So I, <laughs> I'm just like, weird. It's just half an hour has just about killed me of cleaning. <laughs> it's like. Okay, that's a half an hour out of my life. I'll never get back. <laughs> See, that's why I, you know, it's, it, and I had to find something to do with my hair because my hair's just getting wilder. Oh, and my nose is just, oh, it's just nuts because the wind won't stop blowing. Um, uh, God. So I'm going to cook now. Oh, I didn't know. So, sheets are on. Oh, because tonight is a big, I'm doing TV night. And I'm catching up on The Colony, which I love The Colony. Um, love. But I'm going to watch the finale to, um, I think it's the finale of the Project Runway, Junior. And it's so hard for me. 
Sorry about that, but I had to blow my nose again. Um, it's so hard because they're kids. It's like, oh, I want them all to win. I, I, like, I, I, I think I want the sh short black-haired one to win. I'm real good at names now. Um, it's so funny because people will stop me. Like, let, you know, I'm, let's say I'm at the open mall. People will stop and say, oh, hi, Claudette, how have you been? Or call me Charlotte. Um, I, I think I'm commonly known uh, for sure in my neighborhood and um, maybe in this town as Charlotte. I've actually thought about just changing my name to Charlotte. <laughs> how do you get Claudette and Charlotte? It's just because they're C words? I don't know. So I'm, you know, either they say, hi, Claudette, or, you know, people who know me, which I know their names, so those don't count, but, you know, and I'll think, oh, and I know she's a wound specialist. I mean, this is serious. This is what goes through my mind. Oh, yeah, I know. He's an endocrinologist and has two kids, and, you know, I can remember things about them in detail. I don't know what their names are. I was going like, oh, what's his name? Because I actually told him I needed to recommend a friend to him when I did see the endocrinologist. And, I, you know, so I had to go through the phone book. <laughs> I put in endocrinologist in my neighborhood. And I had to literally go through all their names and went, oh, that's his name. You know. But they always, and I feel bad. I just don't remember names. I'm just not a name person. I can tell you all the details about the person. You know, I need coffee. I'm going to drink coffee and start this breakfast bake. See, my thought is, is that my son's here, so I, I was going to vacuum next, but I can't do that. I don't, I think the vacuum would wake him up, but because he, you know, has a fan going. But, you know, I don't need to vacuum that bad. I could do it in the morning. Um, is that, you know, once it's solidified, after I bake it and it cools down, I want to cut it in squares and then just put the pan in the freezer, freeze it, and then take the squares out and freeze them in, you know, saran wrap, plastic wrap. Um, and have them like as little quick brunches because I don't eat breakfast. So brunch, lunch, dinner. <laughs> I'm such a spaz today. I'm really tired. I need a TV night. I need to stop going out and seeing everybody because we've got, you know, we've got really bad cabin fever. It's like, I'm kind of looking forward to the blizzard, ex you know, except for the mammogram. But I'm looking forward to the blizzard so I can just be stay at home. <laughs> well, I'm in the middle of this. I have the pan sprayed and layered with frozen hash browns. I just fried up the sausage, put the can of chilies in the sausage. But then I thought, oh. I got a problem. I have to let the sausage, sausage <laughs> cool because I don't want to cook the eggs when I pour them in there. So I'm letting them cool. I should pour them out of the pan into the... Yeah, that's what I'll do. Because they won't cook the... The, um... It won't hurt the... <laughs> I'm tired. See, I just cleaned for a half an hour. <laughs> I am such a wimp. Well, I love you guys. <laughs> Bye.